Hey guys, quick video on how to set a macro. So you can hit one button to do two things, and in this case it's arming your weapon and attacking your last target. Yes, you may think, oh, I'm going to cross heal my buddy out in the field and then arm my weapon and attack him. It's on you if that's happening, and you can't reset your target to do your thing. But for this demo we're going to use Razor, and let's get into it. First we're going to do is come over here to Arm Dress. We're going to add, let's call it Arm Adam, hit OK, come over here to add target. For the demo, we're doing this Halley right here. Back into Razor. Now we're going to go to your hotkeys. Now that you have this Halley set under Arm Adam. Hotkeys, the dress tab here. Here's that Arm Adam we just made. For the demo, we're going to set it to backspace. Pass it to UO, hit set. Downsize that. Let's go to targets and let's make sure we have a hotkey for attack last target. Let's go control backspace, hit set. Now we're going to go to macros. We're going to create a new one and let's call it arm atom attack. Hit OK. Hit the record button. Now we're going to hit those buttons. Simply equip your weapon and now we're going to well in this case I haven't set atom so we're going to set him to last target. Now attack him using the hotkey we just made. Then we're going to go back into Razor, hit stop. And we're going to remove some of this stuff real quick. We don't want this uh, dress stuff or this absolute target. So we'll delete this. And it's called remove action. And remove action. Now we're going to hotkeys. We go to macros. Here's that arm atom attack macro we just made. And let's set it for the demo called Alt Backspace. Has to go hit set. Let's disarm our weapon, tab out. He's purple because that's the color I'm using, so I know who is my last target. So now we're going to hit Alt Backspace. See how quickly I hit that weapon and attack him? If you want to see it in motion, and come stand next to him, hit it, boom. See that? One, that was pretty quick. You hit the button once, it automatically equips the weapon and attacks the last target. And if you're using the tabbing out and hitting and your spell with one button that we talked about in the other video, that'll look like this. So you're instantly tabbing out of him. It's going to make you faster for the one versus one. Yeah, it might take you getting some use to out in the field so you're not attacking your buddies or getting guard whacked in town, testing out to see if you have your weapons armed and set. But it's going to make you faster. Get used to it. Start using it. If not, make a separate key specifically for this for your one verse ones but you can get the hang of it. Try it out. Get a feel for it. Thanks, guys.